what are the next big things? Like what four or five years from now are we going to look back on and say, man, we didn't see that coming. What, what are some trends or some Firstly, ideas that you think? People are writing off the web two platforms mm -hmm. like Facebook meta. It's not going to happen. Twitter cut forward five years. They're going to have web three integration. All of them. Mm -hmm. mm, interesting. Facebook people have to understand is a 4 billion person network. Yeah. Within five years, we'll have also launched the central bank digital currencies, whether they're private sector ones like Circle. That's my big prediction. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. Or whether they're public ones, maybe the ECB tries to do a public. Either way, that's now given everybody yep. the on-ramp and off-ramp to go into the digital world. And that's definitely coming. The sovereign wealth funds, so these are the big pools of capital from wealthy nations. That's different to the central banks, reserves. This is the, the wealth of nations. That is coming because I know because I'm speaking to them and I know that they're doing it. So that's coming. We also know that all of the investment banks are now building out um, all sorts of products in the space, yeah. the ability for people to trade options. So that's all coming too. We know there's a whole raft of new investment management products that's happening. But the big thing that just happened was $32 billion last year went into VC. So here we are. And you, you see it written on Twitter is what you do in bear markets is build. Yeah, absolutely. This is when you start building businesses. And I'm building two businesses in the space and everybody's doing stuff. What's going to come out the other side of this is wallets, security in ways that you can't, you know, it's so clunky right now. It's terrifying it moving money from your MetaMaster to your ledger and all of that. stuff. So that's all going to get solved. The wallet issue is going to get solved. Integrations everywhere is going to get solved. That's all coming. Then we'll see, I think DeFi, we saw the first wave. Everyone's now learning, building. We've got another wave of that to come. That's going to be interesting. I think NFTs have barely started Agreed. where that's going as a space. The use cases, I think all ticketing is going that way, for example. You know, because everything is a proof of attendance protocol, tickets and all sorts of stuff is coming there. And I think the really big one that I talk about all the time, because I'm also involved in building a business involved in this, is social tokens. So we barely seen them yet. So I talk about them. People go, I don't really know what you're talking about. Board Ape Yacht Club, well, Yuga Labs, amongst their three projects, had about an audience of about, call it 40,000 people. Those 40,000 people owned a bunch of OG assets. Then they launch the Ape token, and the Ape token is worth $3 billion or $4 billion as of today. Okay, where the hell did that come from? Four times the size of the original assets? It's because everybody wants to be involved in that community and this is your currency to be involved. And we haven't started where this is going. Every sports team, every massive pop star, every film, movie franchise, fashion brands, it's all going this way. So the NFT craze we've got now cut forward to three years time and we're all going to be talking whose networks do we own a part of oh my god i've just discovered this pop star they've just had a massive number one hit single my token's gone up 300x oh, wow. that's the world we're going to go to